Flyon has a total of five display screens that I can activate or deactivate, which can be done in the settings menu. Here we can see the dynamic screen, which shows you your speed, your distance, and your currently chosen riding mode. The dynamic screen will automatically change should one exceed a certain speed, meaning all the icons will appear, leaving only the current speed displayed. At which speed the icons disappear and actual speed enlarges can be manually adjusted, but more on that in another video. By using the turn knob, one can switch through the different screens. The training screen, for example, as shown here, one can see the motor output, the biker's power output in watts, and one can also see the biker's calories used. Important note is that the calories are only displayed after successful profile completion. If no profile was added, the speed is shown a little bigger with the speedometer scale like the one displayed for the biker's power output. The actual trip in minutes as well as the distance ridden and the cadence are shown here. The next screen is the performance screen. Here we again see our speed, our motor output power in watts. Here in the middle, one can see the biker's torque as well as the motor's torque in newton meters. So you can compare the torque of the motor to the torque of the biker. And once again, at the bottom left is the distance and the bottom right, the cadence. The two next screens are static screens, displaying the averages of your current trip, like your average speed, your average riding time, and your average power output. And on the last screen, you can see the same, but as your maximum values, such as the maximum speed or maximum power output of the rider. Now here I have deactivated two screens because I don't currently need them. So if I now flip through the screens, all I see is the dynamic screen, the performance screen, and the maximum value screen. Something to note is that on the maximum value screen, one always sees the entire motor usage in hours, as well as the entire distance in kilometers. The motor has been written. Both values can be set to zero, even after a factory reset. 